forgive me ahead of time if I'm putting you in a difficult place, but your song Goat is so good. Oh, mm. yeah. And the lyrics are so important. Uh. Um, I know sometimes MCs don't always know every lyric that they put on a record unless you're out there performing it. Yeah. But would you? can you do some of Goat for us? Could you do some of kick some of them lyrics? Yeah. Because I think the people need who they watch ask. this show need to hear some of them lyrics. For sure. Especially towards, I mean, and I'm going to let you just... Can you give us some of that song? They ask, who's the best MC, Biggie, Jay-Z, or Nas? Aubrey Graham, Jermaine Cole, Kendrick Lamar, Weezy F, Eminem, or Tupac Shakur? Well, I think it's about time that I make a mention, your boy. I ain't even dropped an album. I still ain't been on a tour. I ain't got no platinum records, and I ain't won no awards. You know, you fight uphill battles while pushing the culture forward, and the shit they neglect you for make the legends respect you more. Mm. See, now the game is based off narratives and comparisons. Anything could be true if you get enough people sharing it. How could the facts be faced when this shit is opinion-based? Anyone could enter the race with a mic and an interface. <laughs> That's why I think I'm the GOAT. I got the glow and the greatest flow. I inspired y'all to push more than dope. I gave you hope. Just because you rap like you woke don't mean you dope. You <laughs> preaching to the choir about some shit we already know. Man, niggas broke. We ain't trying to hear all them Malcolm quotes. But if that's what yeah. floats your boat, don't let me sink your ship. It's hard enough to catch a wave while trying to anchor this shit. So look, what makes somebody the GOAT besides the world relating to everything that he wrote? You got to keep a loaf while keeping culture afloat and not just musically. I'm talking all inclusively endorsements, fashion, movie roles to act in, to be a GOAT. You got to be great outside of talent and you can't act the of all time. If it ain't classic, most of your shit be passive. It's just a bunch of fucking captions. Shit, I guess I'm asking how could somebody be the greatest of all time if LeBron never got to face MJ in his prime, but Montana never got to take the field versus time. Uh -huh. If Mike Tyson never got to see Ali in his day, how could Floyd be the GOAT if he ain't see Sugar Ray? Mm -hmm. Imagine Rakim over 808s mm -hmm. or NBA Youngboy doing a song with Mace. Mm -hmm. That's why I feel like we should just end all of these debates because everybody's a GOAT because everyone made a way. This hip-hop shit made a way for us to be great. We no longer pushing weight, but we still fighting for fame. That's right. It's bars. <laughs> <laughs> and that's gold behavior. Yeah. And you perform, yeah. And then at the, end of the song, the at the end of the song, you bring in other people who are not MCs. You bring yeah. in, if you take that's care of the kids, the nigga, you the goat. Yeah. If you, if you old and you dope, my nigga, you, you the oh, goat. See, that's why I felt yeah. like he was talking if to you me. If you ain't dying, you get to him. Embrace it, Tyler. Embrace it. But it's like, but it's like, it's real because think about how much you inspire, bro. Mm -hmm. How many goats you inspire mm -hmm. from but a black star? From a, you know, one of my favorite projects from you, eardrums. Oh, thank you, brother. That's one of my favorites. That's too. one of my favorites from you. Thank like, you. Like that inspired me just on like learning rap hooks. Mm. You know what I mean? But it's like think about all the greatness you inspired. Well, see, when you say in the song, when you talk about, like, when you said if you old and you dope, I felt that because I'm like, yeah, I'm old and I'm still dope. Yeah. But when you said uh, the part about being woke and just because you you spit yeah. and woke, that I, you know. Yeah. The challenge I have as an as a MC for my whole career is being dope. Yeah. Like I always say, people don't check for me because I talk about Malcolm X or because yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, spitting yeah. consciousness. You dope. There's a lot of MCs that do that and they not dope. Bro, I hate you know when I listen to a rapper and it's like they got all these like change the world lines <laughs> like and it's just like this pro-black just like we woke and the government needs to give us reparations and dedications for the aggregations right. and fecurations for segregation for all the Haitians <laughs> and all the nations and just be like bro you just rhyming a bunch of stuff right. like you're not really saying nothing right right and it's like coming and you from said these, it in the song you're not saying nothing that we don't already know we it's coming from these environments, bro. You know how many times we didn't see a nigga like you? Mm -hmm. You know how many times we, we just talked about this? Sharif. It's like, bro, we ain't trying to hear that today. We out here broke, bro. Right. We trying to get some money. And so you tie it all together at the end because what you're saying at the end is let's move away from this yeah. win at all costs mentality. Let's move yeah. away from this competition mentality exactly. because we should be pooling our resources. Exactly. We should be lifting each other up instead of trying to tear each other down. It's such an amazing song, bro. Bro, on results take time, bro. It's a record called No Sleep. Mm -hmm. I heard the beat, right? I hated the beat. I took everything out of the beat, and it was just the drums left. I had my producers come in and add all these, like, different sounds, right? Mm -hmm. I knew the energy I needed on there. Mm -hmm. The energy that made me want to make that song was this kid named I Don't Know Jeffrey, mm. right? 
I could have went in there and tried to duplicate his energy. I couldn't do it. Mm -hmm. So I called Jeffrey to do it. You know right. what I mean? It's a balance, bro. Right. We all could. He's good at that. I'm good at this. I don't got to try to do what he do. Right. That's right. Just because I like what he do and I want people to like, you know what I'm saying? Right. It's like, let me do what I do. He do what he do and we could do it together. Yeah, man. You know? Yeah. So I appreciate you for saying that. What we don't start it. Look at what we don't start it. This the people party. When opportunity knock it, then young nigga move that dough. Get your foot stuck in it, call me young, go get it. They can't fuck with it, my slow go with it.